I tried that water bottle trick and it did not work for me. It was a little bit too wide. So thank you to the person who recommended me putting boiling water on this to help me get the agitator off because I previously could not. And I also um, went under it with a knife, went under that lip and popped it up a little bit. So that also helped a lot. So thank you for that. Again, I did get this washing machine from a friend. So I need some love. Oh my God. Oh my God. So, of course, we are putting that shit in bleach. Diluted bleach, but I was tempted to just full strength that shit. And I'm gonna let this sit while I um, just work on the rest of the washing machine and that middle agitator using some Clorox bleach, um, bathroom cleanup spray. There was some shit in the middle of this that I had to go in and, you know, get out spraying it with a shit ton of Clorox. This is disgusting. Oh my god. I didn't even know what an agitator was. I didn't know you could clean this. So thank you TikTok cleaning community for letting me know about this. This is insane. And if you didn't watch my first uh, video of me cleaning by washing machine and my dryer, then you might not know that I did get this washing machine from a friend that they had an extra one in their garage and I did not have the money to buy a new one at that moment when mine broke down. So I'm super thankful and just giving it some love. Oh my gosh, I couldn't get those out with, um, like by scooping it up with my hands. So I did have to run a short rinse cycle to get rid of that water so I could clean up that whatever it is. And now it's time to take on this disgusting monster. I use Don antibacterial oil.